This is me going into kindergarten um, at a basketball court. And my parents really introduced sports and basketball into my life at a young age, which really impacted me. This is me getting off the bus on my first day of kindergarten. And I remember that during this day, I was very sad and I did not like going to school at Rombrook and leaving my parents all day. This is me and two of my best friends, Ben and Will, after the school play at Roarnbrook in second grade, sitting in the cafeteria, eating a post um, play snack. This is me, my dad and my brother, and they are my other two best friends who have played a very big impact in my life and have always been there for me. In second grade is when I first started to play basketball with a bunch of kids from Chappaqua, and we would play against older teams that would usually beat up on us, but in the end, it worked out good for me because I got to play against really good kids, and that helped me get better as a player. The next year, in third grade, my team and I won the championship game and went undefeated that year. It really showed us that playing against harder teams made us as better players. This is me and my cousins after my uncle's uh, football game, and we really admired him because he was so athletic and played at, uh, at the collegiate level for football, and we always looked up to him and wanted to be like him. This was the baseball team that I was playing with from Chappaqua, and it just was another sport that I was playing at the time, including basketball, football, and soccer. And my parents felt that it was really key to expose me to all sports and not just choose one, so I could really tell which one I liked the most, and it bettered me as an athlete. That was kind of the first half of my life, and now it goes into high school, which was a tough transition, but... I think that my parents, my friends, and everyone who I grew up with really prepared me for high school and basketball and other challenges that I'm going to face. This was midway through the sophomore year of, of my basketball season, and over the summer, my mom was diagnosed with brain cancer, and it was a very hard thing to deal with. And it put a lot of pressure on me and my dad to take care of my brother and, like, deal with school and basketball. And then this was at the Relay for Life charity game during the basketball season where we raised $10,000 to fight a cure for cancer. And she really enjoyed seeing me, my brother, taking a lead of doing this. This was my sophomore year after we lost to Mount Vernon in the semifinals, and one of my good friends, who was also the captain of our team, Jeremy Block, was uh, really upset after the loss, and I remember I went over to him, I gave him a big hug, and I told him everything was going to be okay, and seeing how sad he was after this loss really um, showed me how important this was to him, and how important it, it is, and not to take it for granted, and it kind of made me a better leader and person from this experience. After the season, me and my friends made a football team. As a sophomore team, we weren't really expecting to do much, but we ended up making it all the way to the lead eight, which we lost on some questionable calls. But it was a really good experience, and it brought us closer. In my junior, in my summer going into junior year, I tore my labrum in the last in in the last basketball game of the year and I had to get surgery for it and it really took it hard it took it hard on me because I hate needles I hate going to the doctor's office and I hate being injured and it just really was a another obstacle in my way and it helped me become a more determined and persevering person after coming back from my injury I was able to play in my junior year and I had a really good season, I was, and the team did very well. I received a bunch of awards along with my, along with my teammate Nick, 
and receiving these awards for my accomplishments meant a lot to me and I still have them hanging up in my room and I look at them every day because they mean a lot to me. In my summer going to senior year, my dad got me my first car and I was so happy because I was ready to hit the road and drive around, see my friends and it gave me a lot of freedom and trust that he put into me and it felt really good getting my first car. This was just recently at the end of senior end of senior year basketball year where we won the section championship and it was probably one of the greatest moments of my life that I will never forget. I had a great group of guys, great coaches, great fans, great parents, every everything was awesome and it was just a perfect way to end the season on top. Thank you for watching my presentation. I hope you enjoyed watching and learning a little bit about me.